Hi guys, today we're going to be solving AP1 copy events. Problem states, given an array of positive ints, return a new array of length count containing the first even numbers from the original array. The original array will contain at least count even numbers. So, with every problem, there's different ways to solve it. But the way I'm going to be solving today's problem is pretty straightforward. I'm going to create a new integer array that's the size count. And in this in this new integer array, let's first let's first make the integer array. Let's call it res, and we know it's going to be the size count because it states so in the problem. In this array, I'm going to be adding the even numbers, the first count number of even numbers, and adding them into our res array. To do this, we're also going to need a variable called index. In this, this the purpose of this index variable is to keep track of where we are in our res array. If we if we exceed the number um, possible, the amount of rooms in this res array, then we're gonna get an array index out of bounds error. <coughs> Excuse me. So to help solve that, we can have if condition somewhere in our for loop. So Let's do that right now. So we want to iterate through the entire for loop um, nums.length amount of times. Then we want to check if nums i mod 2 equal equal 0. So what this means is we're checking to see if the number in um, the nums array, if that divides evenly with 2, then we know it's an even number. So if that's true, then we want to res at index. Note how I didn't put i because the i and the very first index, they will differ a lot of the time. So we needed to create a separate variable. That's what we did. Res index will equal nums i. And then we will need to increment our index by one. So if there's a even number after in this case there's an even number four there's the even number four after the even number two we want to place it in the second spot so to do that we just increment index by one okay and after all of this we will return our array hmm. i'm looking over my code and i see one potential error that can happen so in the case where there's more even numbers in the nums array, then there are available spaces in our result array. In array index out of bounds, exception will occur. So to fix this, we can check if index is equal to count, then we just want to stop looking for potential numbers to add into our result array. So we can just break out of the for loop right there. Let's see if this solution works. Oh, it does work. Cool. 